So we greet you for this third Sunday of Lent. Our meaningful meditation finds us in the Gospel of John, and this is chapter four. It's the story of the woman um, at the well who comes in the middle of the day to avoid being around people because she doesn't have the best reputation. So instead of encountering lots of people, she encounters Jesus there who has come um, to get a drink, something, and he asks her um, to assist him. And it's really this beautiful conversation between the two of them and how they are able to help each other. And there's a scholar that talks about this being a benevolent connection, that they both are assisted, obviously, in, in Jesus having this glass of, of water to help him go on with his day, and the woman being offered living water in a relationship uh, with God. And he encourages her to really think about who she is and her story and to see herself the way that God sees her. And he uh, inspires her so much that she goes and she tells other people about this wonderful teacher, Jesus, that she has met. And she's really one of the first evangelists, one of the first disciples that goes and shares about this living water. And the question for us is how we can also see ourselves in that same lens of our story being what has formed us, perhaps stories that have not always been easy for us, maybe we haven't always made the best decision, and yet Jesus is there always offering us um, that invitation to come and to walk this life with him. So that's what we'll be looking at on this beautiful story from the Gospel of John. I want to encourage you to keep working on your devotional that has some great questions, some beautiful pictures also relating um, to our story. And also this weekend is Daylight Savings, so you want to spring forward so you're not late uh, to church on Sunday morning. Uh, we'll start at 10 o'clock here in person and then as always we have our live stream and then a week from sunday wanna uh, encourage you to put this on your calendar for our super sunday dr timothy beal he's a professor at case western reserve in cleveland and so we will be having him come into uh, fellowship hall via zoom so we will all be here in person meeting together and then he'll be zooming in from ohio and it's a, a story that he's written when time is short, uh, research that he's done about the climate crisis. And I know you will learn a lot. And it's uh, a book that raises a lot of very deep questions, but also has some hopeful messages for us and things we can do uh, as a culture and as people of faith. So that will be a week from this coming Sunday that hope you'll come and join us as we continue on our journey together here at University Presbyterian Church. So appreciate your attention and tuning in for our meaningful meditation and we look forward to seeing you on Sunday. Peace for your journey.